it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do your daily vibes for the 16th, 17th. No, 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 no. Well, you know, the timing is fluid, but this is the 17th, 18th. So we'll say 16th, 17th, 18th. But as you know, with my readings, they sometimes don't fall into place until <laughs> whenever they do, right? So anyway, um, keep in mind that if this reading is confusing to you, that's not for you. You shouldn't be confused. It should, you should be able to uh, feel it easily, okay? If you're, if you're not feeling it, then it ain't for you. I cut the deck. I did cut the deck, and, and we... I didn't look at this card, but I just did. Anyway, um, and I came up with the Empress reversed. Now, we are focusing on the future. It's, it's time to, you know, let whatever needs to die, die. And focus on the future. I'm, I'm looking forward. I'm looking forward. With all endings bring new beginnings. So with this card reversed, this, I mean, we have a skull here, which would represent death. Turning my back on this ending, focusing on the future, focusing on what's to come, facing the storm, you know, with the three of swords, facing the hurt. You know, and I don't know if that's a flower that has, has died. It look, kind of looks like it's kind of petals on the, on the ground. And there's the leaves. Yeah, so it's, it's dead. It's dead. It's dead. And it's funny. I just, it is. Something is dead. But this storm will end. It's not going to rain forever. It's not. It's not going to rain forever. Eventually, the sun is going to come back out. So I feel like somebody is... Allowing an ending to be and now focusing on the future. We're going to leave this one in the deck and I'm going to go ahead and shuffle. There's some heartache here that is being healed. Oh boy, that one fell out. So yeah, there's some heartache that is being healed. Some insecurities that need to be dealt with. Trying to work it out. This guy is like talking to himself, trying to work out what happened. Why did this happen? How did this happen? What am I going to do next? He can get up and walk away, but he's choosing to just stay there and mope. There's help inside. There's help inside. And maybe it's right inside of him. Ooh, the Ten of Swords. Stepping outside of your ego, letting your ego side, the ego self die. I mean, that's what this is. The shield, the protection. This guy is looking at, looking back at what happened, looking back at what, what, the battle, you know, realizing I'm still alive. I'm still alive. That was just an exterior. So this guy is kind of looking within as well. And she's looking out. So there's somebody is doing a lot of contemplation about what happened and, and how, who am I? Who am I? Well, somebody is deciding to unblock the truth and realize, accept. I accept. I accept the truth. It's time to face the reality. It's time to face my fears. It's time to face the light. Face the fears, no matter what. No matter what. I'm taking back my power. I have the power. You know, somebody is on 
I'm, I'm heading. I'm heading in a new direction, even if it hurts. Even if it hurts me. <laughs> the tower. The tower. Might as well just go with these. So it, it looks like somebody is rising. They're rising up after a serious blow. There's been a serious blow to the ego, okay? And, and now they're needing to put effort into moving out of this situation and not looking back. <laughs> Same old story. Son of a bitch. Somebody, sorry, I mean, I can't stop myself. I go with whatever comes out. It feels as though I'm, I, it's, it's time for me to take action. It's time for me to re rise from these ashes. It's time. This is, this is death and rebirth. It really is. I don't even need a death card to see that. There's a, there's a, there's a, a an awakening, a rude awakening, a breakdown, an eye opener. Okay. We got an eye opener here. Somebody's eyes are being absolutely opened to what is. And, and what there, whatever has happened is really making somebody think a lot of thinking going on about why this happened why did this happen why 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 and there's there's the reason this happened the reason this happened was because somebody didn't know their worth so <laughs> me i mean the, the empress is all about worth And when you, when, you know, or somebody didn't know your worth, okay? It could be either way. Somebody didn't know what somebody was worth, whether it was yourself or another person. Somebody didn't know the worthiness of the individual person. And it feels like now somebody is, is needing to accept and move on, okay? This, this is over. It's done. It's completed. Okay, this, this lesson that I needed to learn, this side of me that used to be, is no more. It's dead. That side of me is dead. It's dead. And there's really no looking back. Here we, I mean, uh, it's time to focus on the future. And, f and, Go against, go against whatever hurdles are in the way. I have the power, I know I have the power, and I will face any hurdles along the way to succeed. There's a there's a unexpected choice here, an unexpected choice in love. With somebody that is being brought to you from above. Somebody that will compliment you if you can truly move on. from whatever it was that hurt you, okay? There's some, some definite fears, definite fears of, oh, what's the word for it? 
for I don't want to keep using insecurities of lack of self-worth you know what I mean that's 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 big here it's like I'm not worthy I'm not worthy I'm not good enough but you are good enough you are good enough you may feel like you don't have the strength to to move on but you do you may have to get out of your head you may have to deal with your your negative thoughts and and just do it just do it face your fears um I believe there is some sort of happening that is probably coming up. I'm, I'm not sure that this has happened yet. Maybe it has. There is some sort of happening eye-opener, okay? There's some sort of eye-opener that is going to bring two people together, okay? It's going to bring two people together. And it, it, this, this happening may force somebody to face their insecurities, you know, whatever it is, to allow somebody in instead of re asking for help, you know, to, you know, instead of closing themselves off, whatever this is, this happening may, you know, push you to the point of letting somebody help you, if you know what I'm trying to say. Um, this is, this is an exciting, an exciting new opportunity. Somebody that, I think there is somebody coming in. Or they have arrived and they are going to help you to relight that fire to rise again they want to put in effort they have things to teach you you may feel like they you may not trust this person you may not trust this person you may feel like they're all talk because of your own insecurities. You may consider turning your back on somebody because of your own insecurities. Just keep that in mind. Somebody has really been hurt badly. And now they're afraid They're afraid to open their heart again, unblock and allow this new opportunity to come in. Here, we have a decision that needs to be made about love. You have a choice, okay? You have a choice that needs to be made. Are you going to move on and accept the new opportunity? I mean, this is an exciting opportunity as soon as you truly get to the other side of this death that you have been just contemplating. You know, it's like... You know, you know it's time to move on and not look at this anymore. You do. You know that it's time to move on and not look at this anymore. You're still whole. That part of you is dead. That part of you is dead. It's dead. It's time to move on and broaden your horizons and work together with somebody else. There's definitely... I think there's a there's a an option for new love here. There's seduction. There's a coming together that is very unique. 
and it's being brought to you from above. And this is this connection that that's here at this time is going to help you to deal with your insecurities. This this connection, this person is going to help you to stand on your feet again. You know, this this person is going to help you help you to because this is help is inside. And then we got this partner that's coming in to help you. So there is somebody that's coming in to help you. This person This person is going to compliment you very, very well. Okay, and this is this reading is for people that have went through some sort or are going to go through some sort of breakup, perhaps. After a false foundation crumbles and everybody hits the ground and, the, and wakes up, you know, after they wake up from their coma, There's a new opportunity here. I want to clarify this card. Ooh. Yay. I was clarifying this card. There's a there's a a king. It looks like there's a king. A king, your king is arriving. Um and and perhaps somebody is is going to help you put that crown back on your head. <laughs> there is communication. There's some kind of clarity in communication coming through. Queen of Pentacles. Queen of Pentacles. You know, I really feel as though there is there is somebody that is coming to help. Because you have given so much. You have given I mean, the Queen, Queen of Pentacles is very generous, very kind. Secure, stable, abundant. And it looks as though, and this could be, a, this is a Taurus. This is Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, this is Gemini, this is Scorpio. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. I believe that there is going to be some sort of stable offer or revelation even that is coming through. That's going to bring a lot of abundance and happiness to your life. Seriously. And you know what it is? It's because you deserve it. It's because you take initiative. It's because you work hard to succeed. I'm no longer looking back. I'm only focused on the future. When you tell the universe that you aren't looking back... Miracles truly do happen. And that is the truth. I have a story to tell you. But I was going to save it for a live feed. But um, when you seriously turn your back from something that wasn't solid. 
when you turn your back from a false foundation, a false connection, when you tell the universe, this is a universe card, or when the universe helps you, you break that apart, when they help you face your loss, whatever, when they help you, when you really truly face your loss, when, you, when the universe sees that you have faced it, when they see that you have worked it out and, you're de and you've dealt with your insecurities, they will bring you a miracle. They will bring you a miracle, and I'm, it's, it's the truth. It really, 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 really is, okay? So I feel as though there's been some sort of reveal, perhaps even within yourself. There's been a reveal. Somebody has received the clarity that they need. They're feeling abundant. They're feeling grateful for this clarity, feeling grateful for life, abundant successful they've moved on and now there's an opportunity for love and it is absolutely a miracle this person is going to love you for who you are okay this person is going to love you for who you are it doesn't matter what you look like this person is your match okay um and it's because you, you've remained confident and abundant or you became confident and abundant through accepting this truth, whatever it is. You found your power. You found your power. power to move on with the six of swords yes yeah, somebody has moved on and now they have a new opportunity that's what this is i mean i can't same old same old story there could be some news also, that somebody else has moved on. I mean, I'm just saying there could be some news that somebody else has moved on, okay? Because this is like news or communication, moved on. And this is like the death of something. <laughs> just saying. You could be, receive some communication that somebody else has moved on from something. There's a new journey starting, a brand new journey. Divinely guided. All you have to do is step off that edge and keep walking. Look at the, again, the backs. Back, 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 back. Keep walking. Keep walking. Why would you keep looking back? And I understand to look back for a little while at what happened. <clears throat> but there comes a time with the Ten of Swords, there comes a time when you, when, you, when you shouldn't look back. There's no need to keep looking back at the hurt, at the sorrow, at the pain. It's time to stand up and walk away. Walk away. Let it, let it go. Leave it there. Leave it there. Go. It's time. It's time for your fresh new start. It's time for your new beginning. It's time for your new journey. It's time. It's time to accept the truth. And live your life happily. Just be happy. I'm happy. I'm good. And I think for those of you that have gotten to this point of, of happiness, complete and utter happiness, abundance, I'm good. I'm great. I'm taking care of myself just fine. Thank you very much. I've got my shit together. 
when you get to the point of getting your shit together and you're not bitter, and she's not bitter in, in the upright. She's not. She's like, ah, I'm good. I'm fine. Mellow. Very, very mellow. Laid back. When you get to that point of at ease, that's when this, this unexpected lover shows up. So for those of you that are still bitter, then you have to get to this point of at ease. You have to you can't have your back turned anymore, okay? You gotta have your you gotta be facing forward. This is abundance, this is abundant. You need to feel abundance within yourself. Abundance with being single. I am so good. I'm so good. Okay. I'm so good. That I don't have to worry about what happened anymore. Doesn't matter what happened. What matters is the future. That's all that matters at this time. So when you get to that point of being the Empress and realizing that the only thing that really matters at this time is the future. With all endings, bring new beginnings. Stop looking back at the death of what was. Stop. Stop, stop, stop. What good does it do? The storm is over. The storm is over. It is. Allow. Allow yourself to move on freely. And allow somebody to help you heal. There's a, there's a, there's a, there's a, love heals. Somebody's coming in to help you. That's what I see. You've decided that, you know what? I'm taking care of business. You get to that point and somebody comes in to help you with the next step. And it's a joining together that is meant to be. It is. It is. It's brought to you from above. This is a union in which you have a choice. Do you want to be independent or do you want this partnership? Are you ready? Are you ready? Because somebody's coming in to help you heal. Do you want it? Or do you want us to keep focusing on the death of what happened in the past? Somebody's headed in your direction. They are. And they want to start with you. They want to start over with you. Is this a reconciliation? I don't see it. I think this is somebody new. This is unexpected. This is not who you think it is. That's what this is. It's not who you think it is. So for those of you that are hanging on to the death of something, the death of a partnership, whatever it was, There's a new opportunity waiting or coming. It's here. I don't even think it's waiting anymore. I think it's here. And you are going to be called to take a risk. Face your fears. And let this person help you. So, yeah, I feel as though now we have the King of Pentacles. This is stability, security. Um, again, generosity. This is somebody who's coming in to help you. And it's a soulmate connection. We have soulmate, and then these two are soulmates. So there's you, there's a soulmate connection here. There is. Um, could be with any sign. It could be with any sign. There's a new soulmate connection here. It's not with somebody that you have ended with before. 
okay? It's not. It's not. There's a, there's a new beginning in which you are being called to take a risk and start over in a new direction, brand new direction, someplace you have never been before, never been, moving to a new place, brand new, with the Six of Swords. So for those of you that are refusing to stop looking, you're refusing to get up and walk away from this thing that has ended this reading, you know, is a message for you that you need to stop. Let go of that baggage. Don't bring it with you. It's time for you to go. Somebody's holding on to a false foundation. Something that isn't stable. It's not secure. It's not concrete. It's not meant to be. And it's time to wake up. Open your eyes. There's a better opportunity waiting for you. With endings bring new beginnings. And there's a new beginning here with somebody that is going to help you heal. But it's not the person who turned their back on you. Look at this. Look at this. We have the devil. This new person, there's, there's an undeniable attraction between you and this person. And there's a lot of, of passion. And <laughs> I think this is a situation that is coming up. that is very steamy it's very steamy it's very hot and i think it's meant to be i really do i think this is a is a, is a new a new cycle that is about to start that is meant to start at this time to help you remove yourself from this false foundation that you have been involved in these are basically the same people okay they are they're the same people so we have a we have a connection here. That is undeniable. It's undeniable. There's there it is. It's it, and it's not just a bad karma with this devil. It's not because of this card right here. There's a soulmate connection here that is that is the chemistry the the magnetism the oh what's the word the uh desires to be together are going to be so strong that i don't think that you will be able to deny it for those of you that are no longer looking no longer looking at this death you found your power, became abundant, released. There's a new opportunity. There is, there is, there is. But not for everybody because you have to move on first. You have to move on from, from this to have this new beginning. And, and some of you will say, oh, no, that's my, you know what? No, 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 no. Mm -mm. This is somebody new. There's a new connection that is undeniable. This person is coming to help you heal. That's what I got.